Hi everybody, I'm Kristen Spitek, the president and co-founder of National CMV Foundation. Happy holidays. I gave to National CMV on behalf of my daughter, Evelyn Grace, who lost her battle with congenital CMV. And I serve to help protect every child from going through the diagnostic odyssey that so many families face when confronting a congenital CMV diagnosis. We are really working very, very hard to help empower women to learn about prevention methods associated with this when pregnant. And we want to identify every single baby at birth so that we can offer them early intervention services, available treatment options, and help improve the outcomes for both them and their families. We need your support to move forward with some critical research in these areas. Please support our programs today. Every dollar counts. Thanks so much. My name is John Spitek, and I give to the National CMV Foundation in honor of my daughter, Evelyn Grace Spitek, who was born with congenital CMV and lost her life to its effects before her second birthday. And also to the mission to rid this world of this terrible virus so that other families, parents don't have to suffer through the heartache of caring for a child with the effects of CMV and losing, losing their child, but most importantly to the kiddos who suffer so greatly because of this terrible virus and don't deserve to. We need to rid the world of this virus so that our families and kids no longer have to go through the pain that Evelyn Grace went through. Hi everyone, my name is Shane Gaffney and I'm a volunteer at the National CMV Foundation. Just wanna to talk to you a little bit today about Giving Tuesday. So I give on Giving Tuesday to the National CMV Foundation to support their efforts in educating parents as well as raising awareness for CMV. I have been a volunteer for the foundation for about two years now. Uh, I started volunteering because my daughter was born with CMV and has been dealing with impacts from it since then. Uh, I've been fortunate to help other parents deal with their child's diagnosis, raise awareness for CMV through new media, and I've also led successful fundraising campaigns for the foundation as well as for universal screening endeavors. I believe the foundation's mission is important and impactful because one day it will lead to children and their families not having to deal with the effects of CMV. And that's something I can get behind 100%. Everyone, my name is Lindsay Lawless and I serve as Pennsylvania's Community Alliance Chair for the National CMV Foundation. I give to the National CMV Foundation in memory of my daughter, Wynne, who passed away in December 2018 at nine days old due to severe complications from a congenital CMV infection. I volunteer with the National CMV Foundation to serve as a resource to Pennsylvanians looking for information regarding CMV. I am also working with several Pennsylvania parents to pass Pennsylvania's CMV legislation, the CMV Education and Newborn Testing Act. I believe in the National CMV Foundation's mission and I've seen the work that they do firsthand. This organization is amazing. I urge you to give to the National CMV Foundation for this year's Giving Tuesday. Thank you. Hi, I'm Andy, and this is my wife, Anna. Our son, Ross, was born last year at 35 weeks, early because of complications of CMV. He died three days later in the NICU. I had never even heard of CMV before Ross was born, and it's still shocking to me today that he died from a virus that I didn't even know the name of. We give to the CMV Foundation because we want every pregnant woman to know what she can do to protect her baby. Please give to the CMV Foundation today because everyone deserves to know. Hi, my name is Asia. I am a graduate student at Emory Rollins School of Public Health. I feel like the work at the National CMV Foundation is impactful because it is educating women about issues that affect their bodies, um, issues that they may not know about, issues like CMV. And I feel like my work as an intern has been impactful because as a graduate student at Emory Rollins School of Public Health, these are issues that I relate to and these are issues that I want other women of childbearing age to know about. Hi, I'm Megan Pesh. I'm a pediatrician here in Michigan and most importantly, I'm a CMV mom. I give to the National CMV Foundation because they are spearheading the efforts to increase awareness of this virus all over the country. I'm proud to serve on the board of directors and do whatever I can and volunteer my time to increase awareness, prevention, and treatment of this virus. 
I'm motivated by my daughter, I'm motivated by my patients, and I'm also motivated by moms like me. I mean, I went to medical school and I didn't learn much about congenital CMV, and women deserve to know. That's why I give to the National CMV Foundation. Hi, my name is Sally Permar, and I am a proud board member of the National CMB Foundation. The reason I serve is to support all of the families who are impacted by congenital cytomegalovirus and those who are working to end it. And the reason it is, this work is impactful is because we have the chance to give every infant a healthy start at life by eliminating congenital CMB.